All right, hey YouTube. This is our review video for Asylum in Wonderland in 3D. Now, I've said before that I was going to do some cool stuff with the glasses in the background, but I, I just couldn't think of anything to do, so I, sorry I, I didn't do that. But you can check out our walkthrough video. That does work with the chroma, key, the, uh, chroma depth uh, glasses, which is pretty cool. And that crazy tunnel is back is uh it even works when you're watching it on youtube which is pretty impressive yes this is my personal favorite house this year along with 25 years of monsters of mayhem it is location i which is the shrek 4d ride um uh, which is strange yes uh they have nine houses this year they normally have eight so they had to find a new location for a ninth house and they like, well, let's give Shrek 4D a try. I thought that floor on that in that theater was was um uh, was stadium seating, but I guess not. I, I've only been in that ride once. I mean, it's terrible. It, the it, whatever it is, not really a ride, but it, it's also possible that you know, when, during construction, they, they made a level floor. Um, I always like the 3D houses; they're, they're pretty cool. Um, I was hoping. Like I said, to do to have that they would have a 3D house because I wanted to put something cool in the background, but oh well. Yeah. Um, the tunnel in the 3D house is generally one of those tents that somehow are always out there, mm -hmm. uh, but for some reason they put this one in the uh, Shrek Theater and uh, had the tents for other houses. Yeah. I I want to say that this is um this is a sequel to. Uh, Halloween Horror Nights 18 Scare Zone um, back in 2008. Uh, so this is the, I believe, third instance of uh, a scare zone becoming a house. Um, uh, the tunnel is very, very powerful this year. Most of the time it, it's very effective. Yeah. This time I felt like I was standing like this and yeah. the, the bridge was actually like this. Well, it's usually, they usually do uh, black light effect. Mm -hmm. Yes. But uh, for some reason, it just, uh, it was pretty crazy walking through there. I had to close my eyes so I didn't go, Whoa. Yeah. And that, that's how powerful it is this year. But it's worth it. Yeah. Um, and there's, there's a whole lot of Wonderland madness. You don't necessarily need to be that studied on Alice in Wonderland or Through the Looking yeah. Glass to enjoy. You just kind of know the basic characters and the basic concept of the story. Yeah. Uh, that's about it. And then you can enjoy it. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, even if you know nothing, you'll enjoy this house. I think so. Yeah. The, uh, the room with the Mad Hatter was interesting. And of course, there's a white rabbit. Yes. Uh, which is there two times. Yeah. So let's go into heavy spoilers. Okay. All right. I thought you were going to mention what the rabbit is. Is that spoily? It, it's, a, it's a good moment to go to spoilers, and I'll, I'll mention okay. where the white rabbit is. The white rabbit is actually the first character that you encounter. Um, at the very start of the house, you go in, and there's the facade with the, you know, the comic book. And then you go through, and just before you hit the tunnel, the white rabbit pops out and goes, Time's up! Down, down, yeah. down! And then you go into the tunnel, which is going down the rabbit hole. Uh, and then he shows up again... Uh, dead on the Mad Hatter's tea table. Mm. And I believe that is a callback um, uh, at 20 Years of Fear in the Hollowed Pass. There was a Alice in Wonderland room and the White Rabbit was laid out dead on the table and Alice was eating him. Uh, so I think that's, that's a callback. Uh, I believe he was alive for the scare zone, mm. at least as far as the picture show. Um, but yeah, I mean, he's the first guy you see, and then you see him again, uh, laying dead on the table. Um, you will see uh, the white rabbit. You will see Tweedledee or Tweedledum. I'm not sure yeah. which one. <laughs> yeah, it's only that's one of them. Crazy sounds. Uh, you will see the dodos. Oh, that's what I'm thinking of, the dodos. Yeah, the dodos. Uh, no, the, you're thinking of the laughing flowers. Ah. Um, yeah, th that's how great this house is. Like, the, there's so much to remember. Yeah. And so much to see that, you, you, you know, you'll start being like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, the, the dodos. And that's a fun room because one of them's bouncing around back yeah. and forth. And, and the other guy's like running around trying to scare you. I don't you. know if it was like a trampoline or something, but that guy's, that, that, uh, that 
that one dodo is bouncing quite a bit. Yeah. Um, you will see the Mad Hatter. Yes. I'll come out at you and put a cane right in your face. That's right. And um, you will see the Laughing Flowers, uh, who kind of come at you and go, Ehh. Yeah. Uh, now, the question is, during all of this, where's Alice? Well, you actually see her a few times, and she appears to be in a straight jacket, hmm. which, which uh, comes from, uh, I believe, and I hope I'm getting this right, Return to Wonderland, where uh, all of her stories about Oz and the Emerald City worried her uh, aunt and uncle, and they took her to an asylum, and the doctors there deemed her insane. Hmm. Uh, because at the end of the, um, of the house, you see Alice in the asylum and you see the doctor being all crazy and kooky and, you know, that, that's the end of it. And then even even says in the event guy that, um, are these images all in Alice's mind or are they real enough to kill us? Hmm. So, um, yeah, uh, this is, uh, my personal favorite house this year. And I've, 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 you know, I've said that twice. What do you think, Dave? I, I think it's cool. Um, a lot of strobe lights, but you yeah. don't seem to notice it as much. They're, yeah. they're um, strobing uh, black lights. Yes. Which uh, help make it that whole trippy effect, yeah. which is interesting. And um, the, the 3D is really great. Um, yeah. it's, it's a lot of words that are, are popping, that seem to come out of the wall at you. Because they, uh, there's a whole bunch of words, and then there's a few words in a different color. And when you have the glasses on, they float out towards you and yeah. they'll, they make a sentence. Yeah. Like off with his head or something. Off with your head. Off with your head, yeah. Yeah. And um, what's the other one? I, I think down the rabbit hole. Yeah. Yep, that's, so that's our review. Thanks for watching this video and checking out the uh, footage of the house. So if you like this video, please share it. If you haven't subscribed, please do that. And uh, maybe if you're like, yeah, maybe click on it. So thanks for watching.